Hello guys, today on Kids Dream Toys we got Boots and Door Forever book. Come read with us. One morning in Playa Verde, Dora and her friends were busy decorating for a special guest. Dora's friend's boots was coming from all the way from the rainforest for a sleepover. And he was bringing backpack and map with him. That is so cool. I love that clubhouse. But when Boots arrived, he had some bad news. He had lost backpack and map in the rainforest. Dora hugged Boots. It'll be okay, buddy. We'll find them. It was a long journey to the rainforest. Dora and her friends traveled by bus, by train, and finally by boat. They arrived. Boots led Dora and her friends to the riverbank. I put backpack here for a second and... Swiper took her, chimed a nearby voice. It was the chocolate tree. <laughs> he told Dora that Swiper had gone to Blueberry Hill. Just then, Dora and her friends saw Benny the bull in a hot air balloon. Cool ride, Benny, said Pablo. When Benny heard that Swiper had taken backpack, he offered to give everyone a ride. That greedy Swiper... As they soared into Blueberry Hill, Naya spied its swapper sneaking into Issa's garden. The friends landed and found Issa with a very small flower named Bud. Dora, I'm so excited I get to meet you. Are you going on an adventure? he asked. Dora nodded. Come with us, Bud. Vamanos. Dun, dun. The friends followed Swiper's tracks and found the sneaky fox. But he didn't have backpack or map. The big wind had blown them away. Dora, called a voice from above. It was Map. He was whirling in the wind. Dora reached up and caught Map. Map told Dora that Backpack was stuck on top of the tallest mountain. Everyone traveled together through the rainforest to the tallest mountain. Mira, shouted Dora. Backpack was dangling from a tree branch, but she wasn't alone. Tika was climbing up to try to save her. A big gust of wind loosened some rocks. They tumbled toward, straight towards Tico. Cuidado, called the friends. We've got to get Tico off the mountain, exclaimed Pablo. Pablo and Benny guided the balloon towards the mountain. Salta, Tico, Kate cried as they got closer to him. Tico took an amazing jump right into Kate's arms. Tika was safe, but Backpack was in trouble. Dora held up her magic charm bracelet. Condor magical, she called. A great condor appeared, and Dora hopped on it, just as the branch holding Backpack broke. Swooping through the wild gusts of wind, Dora reached out and caught Backpack just in time. Mochila, you're safe, she cried. Backpack was rescued, but the wind had torn a big hole in her. I can fix backpack, but I'll need my sewing machine back in the city, declared Kate. Dora and her friends jumped into Benny's balloon and flew to Playa Verde. Everyone waited anxiously as Kate went to work. Finally, Kate emerged, proudly holding a patch backpack decorated in amazing new colors. She's all done. Hey, bud, come back to Playa Verde, too, Dora smiled at the little flower. You can come with us on all of our adventures. Todos juntos, everyone cried. That's it for today, guys, on Kids Dream Toys.